snowed last night. Yes, I'm glad. It makes everything look so much prettier, doesn't it? And we even love the snow. Jesse, hold my hand, please. Let's go say goodbye to Megan. dress is pretty hot stuff. Oh, thank you, sir. You know, I had a little black dress all planned out, but then I thought about it. Megan would never forgive me. May I join you? Look at you. They say the dress eccentric. In your case, shouldn't you have worn a black dress and pearls? Ha ha. You look perfect. for what you said to me last night. Oh, no, thank you for all your help. No, no, honest. You know, you made me snap out of my self-pity and you made me realize that the loss is not just mine. We shared her life. Not for long. God knows it wasn't long enough. I need you too, sweetheart. Sarah, could I have a moment? Sarah, Jake, would you walk me? I would give anything. Your sister was the most beautiful bride. And the happiest, don't ever forget, Jake. You made her so happy. You know, Megan loved the thought of you out there on the high seas, saving the whales. She wanted to spare you the pain of seeing her at the end. She really wants you to remember her the way she was, her father's daughter. Was she... Uh, was there much pain? No. In a way, the lack of pain made it that much harder to accept. I just watched her slipping away day after day, and there was nothing we could do. All the things that the specialists did, they didn't make any difference. God, I wish you get this over with. It's 
for Megan. Yeah, I know. Come on, Megan was a pro. She always said, start the show on time and keep everybody laughing. Yeah, can you remember when we were on time? Kevin. Kevin, talking to you. Do you believe that the, the dead are still with us? Are you asking if I believe in ghosts? No, I don't. Do I believe that um, something of a person survives his or her death? Something. Um, memory. Their spirit. Something stays with us. I mean, I mean, are you all right? Yes, uh, yeah. And the baby? The baby's doing okay? Yeah. Kevin, I'm, I'm fine. The, the baby's fine. Please, th there's no need for you to worry. There's nothing to worry about. Nothing? I've been worried sick about you and our baby ever since you... If you had any idea how many desk clerks and receptionists I've been talking to to find you. Kevin, you shouldn't have worried about me. Shouldn't have worried. Leanne, I love you. And and you belong here. And we belong together. And I'm just glad that you figured that out for yourself. And came home on your own. As if this day wasn't dark enough. Leanne, darling, I'm so glad you've come home. Thank you. Um Renee, we must join the family. That includes you, mister. Just you. 